Hi guys, so I thought I'd film a bit of an update. Everything is just, oh, really overwhelming at the moment. Um, Yeah, so I'm fully on the, like, pessimist and stuff now. And um, I just feel do lally. Um, stupid things. I like broke my laptop this morning because um, I went to drink some juice. It didn't have the lid on and it went all over my laptop. One of my Mac that <laughs> I've not even had a year. But, um, it's all gone really, really crazy. Um, so I had the scan on um, Wednesday, as mentioned, and my lining is nine mils. So they were really, really happy with that. And my blood test was fine. And they thawed the eggs on the 30th of November. Um, and all seven thawed. So the frozen eggs, all seven thawed. So that was really, really good news. I was quite shocked at that. And because they were ICSI, they all fertilised as well, which is really, really cool. Then um, by, that was Thursday. Then by Friday morning, we were down to six. Um, and one is a little bit questionable. So it's a little bit behind the others, but it's still going. So it's Saturday now and they've still got six, um, but the one is still a little bit behind. And then there's two that have developed really, really fast. So they said they'd keep an eye on those. They might slow down, um, but if they don't, they probably won't use them unless they're the only ones left and they wouldn't freeze them for future use or for if this attempt doesn't work. But they grade theirs uh, one to three. Oh, sorry, one to three is their top grade and we've got four at grade two at the moment. So like, we're both like really shocked because we thought we'd get about five, four, and about three or four fertilizers and be left with one or two. So at the moment, it's really good. I had to be on standby today in case transfer was gonna to be today, which I'm glad it isn't because I have to work in about an hour. It's Tuesday and um, I'm going in at noon. I've been told to not wear deodorant, any sort of scents or anything, um, and they'll ring me on Monday to see how the embryo's doing as well. And they will ring me, no, actually, no, I'm not gonna hear from them again now till Tuesday morning before we go and they'll let me know what they think if I should have one or two put back in. So she says it, you know, they can deteriorate over the weekend. Um, so we don't know how many we're gonna be left with, but so far it feels really, really positive. It was just weird that evening thinking, potentially my child is in this little incubator or children because I actually think we're gonna have some left in the freezer. I feel quite positive, they're very, Every time they like look at my uterus, now it's the right size and thickness, they always say, oh, it's really good, it's really healthy. So I am feeling really, really positive. And if it fails, then we're probably going to have something left to, to try again with. But I don't know, it just feels like it's all going really, really well. So I, I am feeling really, really daisy. Um, I feel constantly bloated. I feel like I look pregnant. My boobs they're getting bigger and bigger and they are so heavy it hurts it hurts turn over in the middle of the night um they're just oh, so heavy and putting the pessaries in is driving me crazy it's just really stressing me out to remember them and i, I have reminders on my phone but it'll be like i'll remember to do these but i'll forget to do these and i'm like oh my god i've got to do these as well and it's I don't know. I just feel that like I'm going to screw something up. Yeah, they're, they're okay. I feel like a bit sore after I've put them in. Um, a bit achy rather than sore. It's just like, I guess it's almost similar to like when you put a tampon in. It can sometimes feel a bit like, ooh, um, so my tummy hurts a little bit. I feel like I'm just bloated all the time. I feel like I'm full all the time. Um, but mood's been okay. It's just my boobs hurt so much. Um, and yeah, they're probably a good cup or two size bigger now. So yeah, it's all going in the right direction. Um, I'm going to do some filming on transfer day, but I am going to, you know, play that by ear um, because it's quite an important day and I don't want to feel like I've got to get my camera out. So it might just be on the drive down and drive back. Um, I was going to work a couple days later, but I think I am just going to take this time for myself because although I'm not worrying about anything, 
I feel quite overwhelmed. Basically, you guys are keeping me going, so I've planned loads of videos I'm gonna do on my week off, so I'm gonna be making loads of homemade gifts. So there'll be lots and lots of videos, um, because I, I love the process. So that's what's good about my laptop this morning. <laughs> but I love the process of the filming and then the editing and then the uploading and then making the thumbnails and things like that. So yeah, it's really good. And I'm having more and more of you Facebook me and Instagram me and I absolutely love it. I really, really do love it. I promised myself, you know, 17 years ago that I was going to do this to help other people. And I feel like it's helping others and it's helping me and... I'm meeting these people and I've got people that are messaging me and we know where each other's appointments are and it's just really nice. I feel like I really am supported. I went like lucky sock shopping and I really wanted elephant socks and New Look had some because we all know that I love elephants at the moment and I also found lucky socks so I'm planning to wear one on top of the other because I can't choose but it'll keep my feet extra toasty. We got this one, but Thomas said I can't wear this one because it says totally e elephant irrelevant irrelevant. <laughs> I just think it's funny, but I think I keep saying like always that I think we'll end up having a girl, and I was like, is this really going to be like really pushing it because they are pink? Um, where this one's got pink and blue on, or am I looking into this way too far? We could just have a green baby. Who knows? But. Again, thanks for your support and I'll see you in the next one. I'm just waffling now. You've probably stopped watching. See you, bye. Bye, 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 bye. Next time, I'll be on my way.